Chief Secretary of the Tobago House of Assembly, Kelvin Charles, sought to clear up misinformation surrounding the relocation of residents from the Crown Point area to make way for the expansion of the ANR Robinson International Airport. He said reports suggesting that those living in the area won't be compensated and would be left to fend for themselves are completely false. So it is totally erroneous, it is disingenuous, and I am saying that if you are disposed to present a case, go ahead and present your case, but do so with information that is credible and factual. He said residents have been advised to have their property assessed by a valuator of their choice so they can get what is rightfully owed to them. Now I'm hearing that if that were done before Section 4 notices were served, then that would have benefited the state. How would that have benefited the state? The persons would be in a better position, if anything, to get a sense of what their worth is and the worth of their properties. And they would have been ahead of the game. As it is, those who did not do that will now have to scramble to get the assessments done. Mr. Charles reiterated that a team has been set up to provide emotional and psychological support to residents of the Crown Point area who will be affected by the construction of the terminal and associated works.